My name is Marcella Maracy. I am a Women's Studies and Biology double major um, in the Stony Brook University class of 2023. Uh, I'm working with Dr. Stephen Glynn in the College of Arts and Sciences Department of Biochemistry. This summer, I researched mitochondrial proteins. Dr. Glenn studies the interactions of proteins in the mitochondria, um, which is really important for um, energy production in the cell. Our project focuses on a protein called tefazin, uh, which helps maintain the structure of the mitochondria. Um, when it's mutated, tefazin can cause a disease called Barth syndrome, which results in severe impairment in the body and an early death. So we're primarily focused on understanding tefazin's mechanisms. This summer, we produced tefazin using E. coli and isolated it using several different purification mechanisms, um, including an NINTA column and ion exchange chromatography, which takes way longer than you'd expect. <laughs> Um, our primary interest was in how and under what conditions tefazin interacts with the mitochondrial membrane. So we basically made these really small artificial membranes called liposomes, and we tested how well tefazin bounds them depending on their composition and the experimental conditions. My entire family is from Brazil, um, and I lived there for a couple of years, so my interest in science definitely overlaps um, with the concern I have for the healthcare disparities there and here and in a lot of different places in the world. Um, and I would say that a lot of the innovations that happen in the molecular world tend to uh, impact healthcare and are definitely a step towards um, more affordable healthcare. During the semester, you have these short gaps of time to be in the lab, so it's like two hours there, three hours here, um, and it's just really not enough to learn at the rate you'd want to learn. So being a Valet Fellow has really helped me uh, immerse myself in this project and become comfortable in the lab environment. Uh, I plan on going to medical school, and I'm really interested in endocrinology, and that field in particular has a huge biochemical foundation um, and makes use of a lot of the techniques that I've been using. So hopefully in the future I'd be able to not only be in the clinical setting, but also in the research setting and be able to use everything I've learned. I'd like to thank the Francis Vallée Fellowship Program and the Panafil Foundation for supporting my research experience this summer. I'd also like to thank the College of Arts and Sciences faculty and staff for making this collaboration possible.